Hey guys, Temple Blush Shell here. Today we're going to talk about the Dabble app. It's another app on the Google Play and iTunes store that pays you to take surveys and you can earn gift cards for your time. There's tons of these out there and the Dabble app has over 100,000 downloads at least on the Google Play store. But what I don't like is it has a 3.3 rating. That's pretty low and I'm going to show you why it's not the highest rated app on the market. But if you've been thinking about finding other ways to earn on your phone or you've been particularly researching this app. I'm going to show you how it works and as always in all my videos I'll explain if it's worth your time as well as how much you can make and again in the end if it's worth your time. So that being said let's jump in and begin. Okay so if you're interested in downloading the app you could do so on the Google Play Store. You could see it here install on your Google Play device as well as the iTunes uh, App Store on the Apple device. So once you do so you're going to sign up. It's going to ask you for your phone number as well as a password. You're going to have to confirm your phone number. It has to be a United States phone number. They don't accept any Google Voice phone numbers or any foreign phone numbers. So if you're going to put those in, it's going to decline you, unfortunately. But if you do have a U.S. phone number through AT&T, Verizon, etc., then you'll get in. Senate process takes about a minute to do. You only need to be 13 years or older to join. Okay, so once you sign up, this is what the app's going to look like. Most of your uh, exclusive offers are going to be on the top here where it says the from dabble and you could scroll through there's this ads here as well as if you go all the way over to the side you'll see that i'll say from dabble research and if you click on these it's going to bring you to some surveys that look something like this asking you about your shop experience with kroger or that and these surveys usually pay anywhere from 5 10 50 points and i'll show you what the points are worth right here you can click on your awards section here and it says you need 5,000 points for five dollars so every thousand points is worth one dollar and when you do those little surveys you're only going to make maybe 10 cents at most and you could see that my earnings are 51 cents because i have 515 points and on top of that you can earn streaks when you log in for say more than four days you get a five percent bonus log in for more than 30 days you get a 15 percent bonus so if we go back to the main screen here all your new unique offers are going to be on the top here and it's nothing special if we were to click on this Jersey Mike's one here we could solve a puzzle and we can earn uh, money here so if we were to play around with the puzzle here really quick goes on to an ad and there's six other things that you'll have to view here so this is again this is a video and I won't bore you with it but I'll go to the end here and I'll show you what we earned and there we go I just wasted probably three minutes of my time for 20 points and then it's just an ad that looks something like that uh, these are what a lot of them are like so every time you do this you're only gonna make again a couple pennies so aside from the exclusive experience they also have offers and tasks and surveys what says from the web and deals and discount what these are, are offer walls you can see tap joy iron source as well as down here tap research and brain and theorem reach and so forth and what these are these are third-party companies that provide them with the surveys and you can find them on so many other websites and they provide them with the information such as surveys or offers and they give them an X amount and they share the profits with you and some companies are greedy and they keep a lot more than others so in my research I've always found uh, superpay.me as well as swag bucks are your best in terms of offers and I looked at dabble clicking on some of these so for example pole fish pole fish and whatnot are just all going to show you a list of surveys that you could find on a lot of other sites so I don't recommend any of these offers surveys are from the web on here and even if you were to use the exclusive experiences that you saw on the top here they're not going to pay you much so that's one of the main reasons that they don't have great reviews and let's talk about that now so again, in the beginning, I said this app has a pretty poor review, 3.3. That's really bad for money-making apps. And at first glance, when you look at the dashboard, it seems pretty simple. Surveys are easy. They have offer walls. Nothing out of the extraordinary. So why does this app get bad reviews? Well, if we go down to the reviews, you could just see a couple of the top ones here. Not worth the install. So once you have the app for a while, you just cannot find any ads to watch or get points. And then it said this one, for example, said they made a bit off the app. However, over time, the games, the goals, and all it becomes ridiculous. And then it says it's better than other apps I found, but it's not worth the time. The longer I've had the app, seems lesser high paying surveys. So there seems to be a correlation here between the longer you have it, fewer surveys you will see. So it does seem like a good uh, app in the beginning. But as you go on, you could see the most helpful reviews aren't all that great. There's uh, some people say they really wanted to like the app. Try to complete the survey several times. They run into tech issues. This could be pretty common, but some companies are better at keeping uh, their app running, whereas some aren't as uh, efficient with the technical issues. And if you go online too, you'll see if you scroll down here, uh, 
Facebook has a 3.4, 46 votes. You can go back up to Apple, 3.9, and they're usually pretty good at positive reviews, 3.9 of 4,000 reviews, time of this review that I'm doing. So again, it's not the greatest uh, reviews, basically because the surveys just seem to disappear. Seeing that this app is rated uh, so low that it's going to take you a while to earn this $5, and, and, and I'm not going to really recommend this app. It's a legitimate company. They have paid out millions, but it just seems like over time you're going to lose those invites. And if you're going to do those offer walls or the tasks, they don't have that many third-party opportunities anyway. So for that matter, I recommend, say, it's superpay.me or Swagbucks. You won't make much with any of these apps anyways. You're going to only make $5, 10 a day. But if you're happy with that, sign up with up. But if you go up with this app, I'm going to say that you're just better off elsewhere. It's not a scam, but you're just going to find your time is going to be better invested elsewhere if that makes sense. So that's going to do it for now. If you want to check it out, I put the link in the description. If not, I have hundreds of ways to make money on Lush Dollar, save money, as well as just being smart with your money. I'm always just creating guides. That's how I wanted to create this channel. Just inform you. You won't find any guides or anything like that. Then I'm going to push to ask for hundreds of dollars from you. That's just how I, how I work. I'll continue to add content, videos, like, comment, subscribe. It always helps me out. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.